Hi, welcome to Chapter 1, Introduction to Coastal Engineering. Now, at the end of this chapter, you'll be able to explain the characteristics of Malaysia coast, recognize the importance of coastal and harbour engineering studies, and respond in order to address coastal and harbour engineering issues. Coastal engineering involves harbour works, navigation improvement, shore protection, flood damage reduction, land reclamation, environment preservation and restoration. Coastal engineering is about knowledge of environmental processes, hydrodynamics processes, meteorological trends, sediment processes, geological processes, long-term environmental trends, social and political conditions, and also others. Now, in the first part of chapter one, I'm going to give you the overview of coastal development in Malaysia. We are going to look at all the ports along Malaysia coast. Development along Malaysia coast. Shore protection as well as shore preservation. Now, for the second part of this chapter, we will focus on problems and issues in coastal area, especially in Malaysia, such as coastal erosion, river mouth siltation, loss of coral reefs, and rise of sea level. Then, I'll introduce the definition of coastal areas. We are going to look at some of the coastal areas features. Then, we will look at the classific classification of coastal such as those coasts classified by the grain size, and the coastal features. Then we will also look at coastal landform. There are various types of coastal landforms. Then we are going to go into related legislation for coastal zone, especially for Malaysia. Now these are various legisl legislation related to coastal zone. And finally, we are going to look at those government agencies involved in coastal zone management. Now, these are uh, most important ones. All right then, I hope you'll join me in the next session. Thank you.